We've been expecting you. Welcome back to the Rideshare Hub. So anyways, my name is Jaton and I am an actor in Los Angeles. Uh, the homie Dylan invited me back for my second video. I mean, but really though, I'm back by popular demand. So um, before we even start, um, go ahead and click the link in the description if you're interested in being a Lyft driver to get that sign-on bonus. Because I mean, it's, it's 2019 coming, you know, new year, new me, new money. So go ahead and be a Lyft driver. Hello? Who this? New phone? You feel me? But anyways, nah, new year, new me. So go ahead and start off the year right by becoming a Lyft driver. So get that sign-on bonus and go ahead and get that money. So anyways, I'm going to go over why... Lyft is the perfect job if you're an actor out here in Los Angeles. First off, and most importantly, we're going to talk about money. Now, I know y'all know the term, a struggling actor. And that stuff is very, very true. You know, you could do a short film because you're just trying to get exposure. A bunch of random films that don't pay you. Some stuff does pay you, but it's really random. It's not a steady job. It's not a steady paycheck. It's not a steady 9 to 5. You can go weeks without having work. And then the next week you have a week full of work. But that stuff is not like, you know, you can't pay rent like that. Like, oh shoot, I got something coming up next month. Can you wait for me? You know, like they ain't gonna do that. You need steady income. So that's why Lyft is the perfect job for an actor because you could turn it on, turn it off whenever you need to. You know, get money on the way to the audition, get money on the way back, and then you're good for the day, you know? Second off, I'm gonna talk about flexibility because casting directors do not care about the time that you have you feel me you work on their time they'll hit you up at like 2 a.m and be like oh call time is 7 a.m what right like you know you can't do that with a nine to five you'd be calling out all the time but with lyft you feel me you could do that whenever you want you know so that's on your time and you're on their time really so i mean casting directors will call you like that so you could do it whenever you want to on the way to audition on the way back and that's that's the beauty of lyft flexibility networking Woo-wee. like I said in the previous video you got to know how to talk when you're in a lift video you got to learn how to network you're out in LA you got to learn how to talk to people because everybody out here does something so you could be driving a lift cast and directors take lift the Sun has set that can only mean one thing you need to sign up and be a lift driver Nah, but um anyways back to what I was saying uh, networking third most important thing um like i said if you drive for lyft dude you gotta be able to talk you have to because there's so many people coming in and out of your car you know if you want that five star rating you gotta have great communication skills great music which is you know um and all of that good stuff you feel me but like there's so many people that take lyft because first off parking is horrible out here in los angeles so you'll meet casting directors actors just people that need actors and it's great to network you know if you have a card or a headshot with you and your car stuff like that you can go ahead and lend it to them most of the time they have cards and stuff like that but it's great ways to talk you know get yourself into a feature film you know if you if you're great at talking they like your personality and stuff like that just go ahead and chop it up so it, it's always great to network um it's a great experience for that because you'll never meet as much people as you do while driving for lyft especially all the assortments of people that you meet driving for lyft are always different so like casting directors all of that stuff you'll meet everyone doing lyft Whew, it's cold out here um whoo buddy so yeah i got pretty cold outside no longer from my toes but we're gonna finish this video um i just wanted to touch base with y'all on a personal level so i brought it inside we're gonna finish this up um if you want to be an actor and you're out here in los angeles first off congrats already you moved from wherever you came from or you're already out here you're halfway there chasing a dream so congrats on that second off it is hard um it is hard if you want to be an actor just to make it this stuff is hard because everybody wants to be an actor you know but that doesn't stop you from being the best that you could be because you are the best you but anyways aside from that it's just like if any tips i could give to getting out there and starting in anything like that um you just got to do it you know like i know you want to you just got to do it connect yourself with people surround yourself with people that are doing the same thing as you you are like the five people you hang around i'm pretty sure y'all heard that somewhere um, so connect yourself with people that do the same thing that you do. Talk to people who are doing things that you want to do. Get to know people. Ask for help. 
seems like a problem that a lot of people have, like asking for help. So go ahead and ask for help. Don't be scared to do that. And this is why Lyft is also great for that as well, because it's like you set yourself in a situation where it's like you have to connect with people. Like, oh, shoot, hey, how you doing? Just a little small talk. Oh, I'm a casting director. What? Yo, guess what? I'm an actor, by the way. You know, boom, pow. You feel me? Your next movie right there. So, I mean, connect yourself. There's plenty of websites out there. You go ahead and look. Don't get scammed, though. So, go ahead and do your research. But there's plenty of websites out there that could get you background acting, um, parts, auditions, stuff like that. Get yourself a camera so you could do a lot of self-tapes and all of that stuff. Make your own movies. Not those kind of movies, but the, the other kind of, you know. Anyways, so yeah, go ahead and do all of that stuff. Get yourself set up. You have to invest in yourself as well before anybody else invests in you. Get yourself some studio lights and all of that stuff, the whole shindig or whatever that you need to do to do auditions, self-tapes and all of that stuff and just get out there. Join groups, you feel me, on all websites and just, you know, take care of business. But it is hard work, it's worth it in the long run and it's possible. Um, so anyways, before I end off this video, like I said, if you're interested in being a Lyft driver like <laughs> your boy, you know, go ahead and click the link in the description, get that sign on bonus and let's start off this new year with new money. You feel me? New friends. Cause I'm leaving all my old friends in 2018. You feel me? Joining with a bunch of acting friends and Lyft drivers cause they the coolest people I know. You feel me? So to all my Lyfts and Lyftettes. You know, have a happy new year. If you're interested in being a Lyft driver again, uh, click the link in the bio for a sign on bonus and get some extra money. Thank you for watching. Go ahead and like, subscribe, and comment. You know, tell your mama about this video. Tell your mama cousin about this video. Tell your mama cousin cousin about this video. And then you just got a whole family full of Lyft drivers. Because in the end, we just need to lift each other up. Y'all see. But anyways, y'all have a beautiful New Year's, you know. Hopefully you're bringing in a lot of money and you join Lyft. And we can all just be a big old Lyft family. You feel me? Happy New Year's.